Hello gamers and gamers, what is going on? My name is Tanek127 and welcome back to another Redfall Guide. And guys, in today's guide, this is going to be a real easy one. I'm going to show you where to go to kill the Shade Tree Killer. Now, you're going to be having a side quest also that wants you to kill someone called the Underboss. And you're going to notice that they're not going to pop up on the map. Well, that's because the Underboss and the Shade Tree Killer are the same person. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go into this safe house, which is located right here in the neighborhood, to Shade Tree Heights Safe House, because this is also part of the side quest for taking over the neighborhood. Just so you all know, taking over a neighborhood just means take three safe houses. Also here on the map, you can see the location of all three of those safe houses. So you're going to want the Old Town Safe House, the Sedgwick Safe House, hope I said that right, and the Shade Tree Safe House. And the Shade Tree Killer is actually located in the house right over here. But um, I'll be showing you guys where that, how to get to him in a minute. If you don't see the Shade Tree Killer spawning, you actually want to just go here to your Safe House Missions board and make sure you also have the Vampire Underboss quest activated. Both the Bellwether quest, the, um, the full side of it, and the Vampire Underboss quest need to be activated for this boss to actually pop up and you're going to see he's actually just a, um, a beefed up siphon vampire anyway guys I'm going to let the gameplay play out to show you guys where to go and how to kill him if this guide helped you smash that like I'll see you all in the next one peace out have a good one there's a whole bunch of random shit that you might be able to use go for it Oh, yeah. I'll see you